in the last episode, we took on Celtic at Celtic Park and we lost 1-0 before we beat Dundee 4-2 at their place before wrapping it up with a 1-0 away win at Edinburgh City in the Scottish Cup. Since then, we took on St Mirren at Easter Road 1-2-1 before back-to-back -back matches against Dunfermline. The first one at Easter Road, 5-2 winners. The next one, 3-1 winners at their place. And then we've just wrapped it up right here, right now with a 3-1 away win at Ross County. In this episode, we're going to take on Rangers at Ibrox in the Scottish Premiership. Then we're going to take on Partick at their place in the Scottish Cup fifth round before wrapping it up with a, a home leg in the Europa League first knockout round. And that's going to get be up against Marseille. Edinburgh, home of royalty, culture, and tradition. It's also home of two classic Scottish clubs, but there's only room for one of them. Welcome to the pride of Edinburgh. So here we are with the first game of this video when we take on third place Rangers. We've yet to beat them in six appearances over the past two years. Um, and we currently find ourselves second in the table. So a win here could open up a bit of a gap between ourselves and Rangers, but it's a tall order because we've never, ever, ever got close to beating these boys. To make matters worse, we've got uh, injury to our leading goal scorer, Fez, so he is out. Um, McGinn is also suspended, so we are going for a little bit of a uh, alternate 11. So, Glover in goal, Bunny, Hanlon, Ambrose, Georgian, Adam, McGow, Tillman, Windus, Murray, and Quintongo up front. And our host going with a 4-2-3-1. I expect a tough one. So, Hibs get the match up underway at a rainy Ibrox. So we are missing two crucial players. How big a drawback is that going to be up against a side that we've always struggled with Morelos with the first effort of the match for Rangers? I would gladly take a point right here, right now. I'm holding my hands up. Quintongo holds up possession, gives out to Windus out wide, loses it. McGow gets it back though. Quintongo shot is up and over. Keeper boots it out. Murray gets control of the ball, tries to set up Quintongo, but no joy. But we get it back and eventually comes to Murray, whose shot is right at the keeper. He saves. Here comes a corner from range, just pumped in there. Wilson's header is up and over. Goal keep by the Big fella at the back. Morelos. Oh, Hanlon shot straight at Glover. And right now, it's it's a bit of both. Everyone's getting control of the game, which is, is good in my eyes. And there's another good effort by Rangers. It's eventually kept out, though. Ross are now for Rangers. Pina sets up O'Hanlon. Still bodies in the box. Eventually goes back out to Pina. His shot goes wide. So um, we're holding our own at the moment. Don't really want to think about any changes big challenge charlie adam in there with a good shot but it's pushed behind by forderingham and adam will take the resulting corner comes out to tillman back to adam he plays a bad ball and here come rangers on the counter boymans gets across in there's blocked by bunny and glover will boot out to somebody and here comes georgian back to glover murray quintongo back to mcgow tillman Runs and Quintongo's in there. He looks a bit offside, but I'll take it. 1 0 up at Rangers. So, so far, so good. Um, Quintongo has been scoring some goals recently. Started him out on wing, but he can play up front like he's doing today. Adam Tillman brought down. Here come Rangers with O'Hanlon. Body in the box. Bowman's puts it up and over. Georgian, Adam, Tillman, Murray. That's the second by the cherry, but it's cleared by Rangers. Free kick. It's having it puts it up and over. 40 minutes gone. Can we hang on? Corner. Wilson's header puts put over by Glover. They got another go at it. It's blocked by Hammond on the line. Here comes Charlie Adam. Back to Glover. Nice wise set of heads. Heads. It was a wise head by Adam there, keeping the, playing the right move. Adam McGow. Windus is offside.
I'm gonna. It says Adam's got an injury, but I need to keep him on the park anyway. Georgian with a free kick. McGow. Adam. Tries to slip in Quintongo's shot. It's over the bar. Looking. 45 minute mark. Bruno Alves. Free kicks. Poorly taken. Windus collects it for Hickam Rangers once again with Majorca, Rosta, Morales, Holt. Boyman's has got an injury. That shot is wild. And that should hopefully be the lot of the first half. And for once, we look pretty decent against Rangers. So second half gets underway, keeping it as is. No real changes. In fact, there's no changes whatsoever. I want to keep it as is. Hopefully they do not score early. I will still take a point. But if I can get all three, that would be balmy. Pina for Rangers. Sets up Holt. Candiaris. Rossiter. Wilson, Morelos, Pina. A lot of build-up. Bunny clears it, though. Murray tries to set uh, Quintongo up, but no joy here. Come the Rangers once again. Long highlight this one. Eventually, Bunny clears. Murray chases it down. Looks for somebody. Here's Adam, McGow, Windus. Here come Rangers. McGow again, though, breaks it up. Who is going to get this highlight? It looks like it's going to be Rangers, but it's one of those highlights that didn't really amount to anything. Here come Rangers, though, from the throw. Pina, Candias. Rostered over the top for Majorca. Glover collects. And what's he going to do with this? Good. You pick a good pass. Pick a good pass. And that is okay. McGow. Windus. Dances around. Gets a cross in. Someone get a shot. Tillman's effort is wide. It was a good effort, but not good enough. Here come Rangers. Glover collects. Again, pick a good pass. Murray. Tillman over the top for Quintongo. He's onside. Looks like Fordham got a touch. It will be a corner. Adam will take it, floats it in there, gets another bite of cherry, comes out to Murray from distance, sets up somebody else, but here come Rangers. 55 minutes gone. Georgian with a throw. Quintongo, Windus. Over the top of Quintongo, the chase. Can he get cross in there? There's bodies in the box. Tillman can't get it in the back of the net, though. Just shy of the hour mark. Just shy of the hour mark. We, we, I don't, I don't want to say this, but I'll, I'll hope, I might have to say it at the end. Adam, the corner, Murray, snapshot, if we can get a second, if we can get a second. Georgian, McGow, Georgian, McGow, Adam, Murray, Quintongo, again, four of has to stretch. 75 minutes gone, 15 minutes to go. Bunny, Tillman, Adam, McGow, Adam, Tillman, Quintongo, Murray's effort again, Fordering tips it behind. Another corner. Adam will take. Floats it in there. Mario collect. Back to Adam. Comes out to nobody. Nine minutes to go. Corner. Adam's right at a Rangers player. Gets a second go at it, but here come Rangers. No, Bunny plays it forward to Tillman. Quintongo's shot is blocked. And here come Rangers now with Candy Ass. Can we tackle him? Oh, Hanron. That shot is tipped behind. Finger tip behind by Glover. Tavern will take the result. Corner. Morelos. His effort is bad, and it goes up for a goal kick. What Glover will take towards Quintongo. Headed back, Miguel. Quintongo. Stores plays brought down. Morelos tries to set up O'Hanlon. And again, Glover to the rescue. Taverner's corner. Poor. Last five minutes. Last five minutes to hang in there. Adam with a free kick. Pumped it in there. He'll get another little rocket here shot, and that is up and wide. Looks like Windus has got an injury. Uh, so, in fact, I did make some triple changes. The Tinker Man may have struck. Here come Rangers, Lenahan, Candias, Jack, big tackle, Holt, Rossiter, shot up against the player, or go out for a throw. 90 seconds to go. 90 seconds. It's less, it's actually a minute. This could be it. It should be it. Lenahan. O'Hanlon. Holt. Lenahan. Holt. Come on, ref. Georgia now. That should be enough. Dragomir. Murray. There it is. What a result for Hibbs. First ever win over Rangers. And it came at Ibrox. And I was going to say this earlier, but we were the better side. We deserved that three points. We looked. We looked the stronger of the two sides today. That result keeps us in second spot and opens up a bit of a, a bit of a gap between us and Rangers. Uh, obviously, we've got no chance of catching Celtic this year. 
but just the fact that we're looking like we're going to make some progress up the table, which is which is what this is all about. In the second match of this video, we take on Partick in the Scottish Cup fifth round with a place in the quarterfinals at stake. Currently, Partick top the championship as Hibs a second in the Scottish Prem. Both come into this in excellent bits of form, so it could be a tough one. However, I have decided to mix it up a bit and play a fringe 11, uh, and it includes Bun in goal, Bunny, Hanlon, Johnson, Watson, Barton, McGow, Swanson, Dragomir, Emmanuel Thomas, and Madden up front. On the bench, no major hitters. In fact, Murray, Quintongo, Silvaker, probably the guys who can change it should we need to. Our host going with a 4-2-3-1. Pretty midsection. In fact, we're going we're going at each other head on. So packed out Parktick Stadium. And uh, Parktick get the match underway. Let's just see how much of a divide there is, or if there is any at all. But here come Partick with the first bit of pressure. And again, Bun has worked into some action early doors for the first five minutes. Gets a first touch of the ball. Miller, throw in. Here comes Madden. He's on his own up the top. He's got a supporting cast with him. Watson collects back to Bun. Punts it long. Hanlon collects to McGow. Bad pass. Here comes Partick Anderson. Doolin. Shot in there. Bun's about to work. And it's eventually another shot at him. He saves against us. Two quick fire saves for Bun. Keep him on his toes. If you recall, I did bring in Bun in the January transfer window on a freebie. We lost Marciano, who's gone on to pastures new. Here comes Hibbs, Miguel, Watson, Manuel Thomas, Dragomir. Sets up Madden. Beautiful goal. And we are in front. Madden gets uh, back on the score sheet. Here comes Partick, though. It's not over. Miller. The shot is up and over. Corner for Partick. Not a good one. But they get to go again. Bannigan. Miller. Broken up, Dragomir, Madden, come deep. Manuel Thomas, McGow, Dragomir, Madden. Tries to set a button, but it goes wild. And here comes Partick with Story. Over the bar. What's this, a penalty? No. Button with a goal kick, boots out towards Manuel Thomas, McGow. Loses it. Here come Partick, Elliot, Doolan, over the top for Story. And that shot is put wide. The corner out for a throw. Manuel Thomas cleans up, sets up Dragomir, who can set up Madden. His pass is poor, and here come Partick once again with Elliot. Dances around one, gets a good cross in there, should put it on target, but he doesn't. Look at that, seven shots to the one, and then another bit of a scramble in front of the Hibs goal, but it's cleared. We live and breathe again. Free kick for Hibs. Hannah takes it, then ventures up with McGow, Manuel Thomas now. Dragomir. Bad pass. Here come Partick once again. And that shot is, is a good effort, but it's wide and it'll be a corner. It's headed clear as far as Story, who's snapshot again, makes Bun work, pushes it out wide. Yet another corner for Partick. Where she comes out to Story, his shot is pushed well over. It'll be a goal kick for Hibbs. Bun puts it long. Partick have really go, given it some today, and that effort is close. 12 shots. For, uh, for Partick compared to two for Hibbs. One of them on target, and that was the one that went in the back of the net. Bunny punts it long towards Madden, but no joy. Partick try and build again. Hibbs get lucky with a lucky bounce. Mano Thompson's Thomas floats it over the top for Madden to chase. Story now for Partick, though. Sets up Doolan, major tackle. Hibbs can maybe breathe, but they can't. Here comes Story with a breakaway, and that eventually goes out for another corner. Partick really putting us under some pressure. Everything at, at us, the kitchen sink and all that kind of stuff. And Watson tackles it out for a throw. Bun punts his long goal kick. And once again, here come Partick. Hanlon clears. There's a good bit of a workout for the defence and the keeper. One of these is going to go in the back of the net, surely. 16 efforts, 11 on target. Watson, free kick for Hibbs. Barton puts over the top of Manuel Thomas. Again, it comes out for Partick. It's all Partick at the moment. Osman, again, that effort is trickles wide. 
but we're just about to get to the halfway mark. We're still alive, we're still in this one, but only just. So despite the fact that we are winning, I've made a couple of changes, uh, I think one really, uh, but I've switched it up to go attacking. So, because I feel that we are, we are getting bamboozled here and we're gonna end up with egg on our face if we don't get a second goal. Swanson, I didn't even know Swanson was on the pitch, Bunny. And here come Partick with Doolan, Story, and they are now in level with us, 1-1. One, one. It was coming. It was coming. Maybe because I've gone attacking, it's opened it up at the back a little bit. So now Hibs have got to find something. Quintongo. The substitute gets a cross in. Miguel collects. Sets up Barton. Swanson shot. Fingertip save. No. Goes out for a goal kick. Scully boots it long. Towards Elliot. Barton collects though over the top. Scully will collect this one, looking for an option. Boots it. And then cleans up. Watson now for Hibbs. Quintongo. Miguel over the top for Madden. His effort is ambitious, to say the least. Quintongo. Barton over the top again. Scully collects. A bit more passion from Hibbs, but no end product. And here come Partick. They look the hungrier. Claw themselves into this game now with that goal. And if they continue where they left off in the first half, it's going to be an embarrassing defeat for Partick. So, 60, it's over the hour mark, we've got less than 30 minutes to go. Changes are about to come into effect. Can we get that elusive second goal? Because I do not want to drag this into extra time. Barton, a weak, weak pass by Barton. An Osman shot eventually comes out for another corner punted in there Mip Swanson just rids it out for a throw three kick though Miller story come on hustle him a bit hustle him a bit float over the top Quintongo now to Murray got Dragomir and support bad pass by Murray comes back to Partick picked up though here comes Hibbs Dragomir Silvica the sub is shot straight at Scully Scully boots it long towards Anderson. Big tackles. Eventually does fall to Anderson and his shot is wide. Watson, Silverka, Barton, Swanson. Get across in there, Bunny. Barton gets the touch. Finally. We've got our noses in front despite all the pressure. Partick 1, Hibs 2. But straight from kickoff, which is always ominous. Feels like there could be a goal. But here he is, Dragomir. Over the top now. But here comes Partick Anderson. Ooh, unlucky chief. Unlucky. Last 10 minutes to hang on in there. Watson with the throw. Quintongo loses it. Here comes Partick with Doolan. Sets up Anderson. Oh my goodness. What a way to concede. It's now 2-2. Partick right back in it. We're still attacking though. So... Let's do more bust. As we reach the 90. 2-2. Two, two. Four minutes of injury time. Bunny, Swanson, Murray. Over the top for Dragomir. It'll be a corner. Barton will take it. Poor and here come Partick. Brannigan hustled by Johnson. Dragomir, Silverka. Can he get across it? Can he? He went for it for himself. But it'll be a corner. Dragomir, Quintongo's effort. Again, it'll be a corner for Hibbs. It's finally starting to show a bit of desire. But it looks like it's going to go to extra time, folks. Watson, Dragomir. Punts it long, and that'll go out for a throw. Keown will take it. And there it is. In fact, I think we go to a replay. But we go again against Partick, who kept us at bay. In the last game of this video, we take on Marseille in the Europa League first knockout round, first leg. Um, it's going to be a difficult one. Uh, we're going to play very cautious and hopefully we can just keep it alive as we take it to their place later on. So my start at 11 for this match is a little conservative. Glover in goal, Lazzaroni, Hamlin, Erkson, Georgian, Silverka defensive mid, Tillman, McGow, Adam, Quintongo, Murray up front. Still without the likes of Fez and McGinn. A lot of unregistered players. So we are going pretty much uh, bare bones. And our visitors... Going with a 4-2-3-1. So, Marseille, get the match underway. 
So a lot of good talent on the pitch for the French side. Can we compete with the big boys? We have drawn against Porto previously. We have beaten Hoffenheim. So uh, we shouldn't be too afraid. It could have been a lot worse. You see some of the sides in there. And that shot is up and over. Paye, Gustavo. Silva could tackles and here come Hibbs over the top for Murray. Can he do get a shot on? It's put behind, but it's a goal kick. And Marseille build from the back here. Gustavo, Paye, Gustavo, Paye, Munir, Gustavo, Paye to Capella. Oh, Campos crosses in there. Munir puts Marseille in front. Slow build up. Taking advantage, really. Taking the piss, really. Not advantage, taking the piss. So, free kick is badly taken, and here come Hibbs. Maybe, maybe, just maybe if we can get across in there. Tillman's effort straight at the keeper. It's not a bad effort, but I think really we're going to have to change it up at the second half and just give it a go. Just give it a go. We've kept him at bay for a half. Now let's give it some. Hibbs nil. Marseille won. So, Hibbs get the second half underway. We are now going to crank it up and try and attack. Tillman. Dragomir. Tillman gets a cross in there. Nobody's there, but they put it behind for a corner. And it must have amounted to nothing because we don't get to see any of it. So, 53 minutes into the match. We're still behind. Hand it back to Glover. Punts it along to Quintongo. Silvica loses it. Here come Marseille with Munir, goal scorer. Oh, Campos. Second goal for them. We're really rubbing in our wounds. Murray's got an injury. Picks out Dragomir. Can he get across in there? Silvica gets a head on. Mandara. Man Mandana. Mandanda. Saves. Corner for Marseille. Cabello will get another go. Crosses in there. Quintongo breaks. Can he get across in? Silvica. Murray. Oh, it's in there. Dragomir taps it in. What a flipping turn of events. What a turn of events. I'm looking, do I do I risk it and take Murray off or do I leave him on? Because the second leg, if we get Fez back, we might just give him a go. Last 15 or 16 minutes. Munir, his shot hits Glover, will be another corner for Marseille. Gurukuf pumps it in there. Quintongo heads it. And as far as Munir, his shot straight at Glover. This is where heroes are born. So, made a change. Ballsy. Youngster coming on for Murray. Paye. Big tackles coming in. Quintongo, Tillman, his shot is wild. Big efforts by Marseille. Tillman, over the top, here comes Dragomir. Oh, would you believe it? Fingertips saved by Mandanda. Tillman floats it in there. Can anyone get on it? No, here come Marseille. He's broken up though. Creep and crawl to the 90. Five minutes of injury time. Marseille. Oh, Glover. Had to come out. Be bold. Glover boots it long. Here come Marseille. A, a, a goal right here right now would make this a sour result. Glover boots it long towards Quintongo. Tillman. Lazzaroni. Galantes. Silver shot. And force a corner for Hibbs in the dying minutes of the game. Silvica can get to this. Tillman get across in there. McGow. Corner. It's not corners, a free kick. And that's your lot. And that is your lot. Uh, it's not all doom and gloom. Uh, we do have a chance to rectify it in the second leg, but 
Marseille do have that elusive away goal. And that, my friends, completes this video. So not a bad turn of events for us. That result against Rangers puts us right in commanding position for that second spot. But in the next episode, we will take on Marseille and Partick and another Edinburgh derby. If you've enjoyed this video, you might want to check out my other two game saves. Glory on the Rhine featuring Schalke Nulfia and Reach for the Summit featuring Real Sociedad. Until next time, thumbs up, subscribe, ciao for now.